But in America, another bad boy bandit is never far away. The neighborhood raccoon is an animal with an unusual skill. With longer back legs than front, these guys are all about smarts. They can rotate hind feet to point backwards, climbing down trees head first, if the branches hold up. This one-year-old raccoon has grown up in the country where raccoons share, and there's room for everyone. Now, like lots of raccoons, he's heading for town, where food seems plentiful. Problem is, there are 20 times the number of raccoons in American towns and cities than in rural areas. So the country boy has some serious competition. City raccoons use their smarts to hustle food. Using a wide lower body and low center of gravity to push over large objects like trash cans. They have dexterous fingers. The area of their brain dedicated to the sense of touch is among the greatest of all known mammals. They soak their paws to soften hard skin making them even more touch sensitive. Black bandit masks may enhance night vision and help keep glare out of their eyes. Now the country boy has been eyeballed in bandit territory. This raccoon is ready to defend his food. Snacks down. It's time for a smackdown. They size each other up. Equally matched, this fight will be down to skill. Country boy snaps. It doesn't phase the bandit. Nervous, the boy has second thoughts, but he hasn't eaten for days. This downtown throwdown is about to get ugly. In this street fight, anything goes. Raccoons fight mean and dirty to unleash their killer move, the Death Shake. For these raccoons, there's a feast at stake. Fur flies. The country boy grabs the bandit by the tail as far from his mouth as possible to avoid being bitten. Bandit gets the boy down. Time for the killer move. Forty teeth, including four sharp canines, clamp on to country boy's neck. With a move usually used to stun prey, the bandit tries to disorient the boy with vicious shaking. Time to take out the trash and go in for the kill. The law shows up. A distraction, saving the country boy's skin. He gets away with it this time, but this boy's got a long way to go to become a bandit of the burbs.